Good Sunday morning to you. This Velcro Weather Hazard sub-alert will go into effect at about uh, 10.30 a.m. through about 7.30 p.m. Just from marginally strong gusty northwest winds raking the area just behind a departing area of low pressure that will be tracking south of uh, Nova Scotia. It will be drawing in with a fairly strong pressure gradient. Winds that have been blowing across Pennsylvania, parts of New York, and into southern New England a little further north. As this shifts north, however, these winds will start to decrease a little bit in intensity, but also be aided by some strong mixing. Those uh, mixing winds aloft at about uh, five to 7,000 feet will get down onto valley floors once convective trigger temperatures are achieved. That looks to happen sometime around uh, 10, 10, 30, 11 o'clock this morning. And with uh, ample sunshine indicated upstream here with clearing skies, we're looking at uh, best possibility for strongest winds along the spine of the southern Green Mountains, maybe into the central Green Mountains and points east, immediately downsloping uh, east toward the Connecticut River Valley. However, this looks to be like a low impact uh, situation. Uh, we had a very similar situation take place uh, recently, and the net effect was that historically, um, the strongest winds stay to the south. Where they'll be the strongest, I think, is through the Mohawk Valley. You can see some lake effect bands also affecting that as well. And uh, the Mohawk Valley into the Berkshires of Massachusetts and then into the spine of the southern Green Mountains, generally around Bennington and Wyndham County, will be the strongest, uh, what looks uh, with many of the latest computer models from overnight. So taking a quick look here at the uh, HRRR model, this is a valid 11 o'clock. Uh, this is the area that we uh, will try to confirm here later on this morning. And across the southern tier areas, these wind gusts across the Catskills. So the translation of those lighter yellow colors there, uh, greater than 35 knots, um, about 40 miles per hour, we're in that realm here. It looks like the Mohawk Valley is definitely under, gun, under the gun here, and the uh, southern two counties of Vermont seem to have the strongest winds. And then uh, good mixing conditions will broaden those winds out across a wide area, especially east of the Green Mountains, very notable. This is uh, valid about 6 o'clock. So you can see the strongest winds in those lighter yellows moving through here, but also as they shift to the north and east, the winds uh, decrease, uh, at least intensity, uh, does fall off some. That's what I'm counting on here for low impacts. And a quick look at uh, precipitation, the uh, exiting system through the Gulf of Maine, moving very quickly out. Leaves us with a little bit of flurry activity from time to time along the uh, portions of the Green Mountains. Roger Hill, Weathering Heights.